everybody. Here are gonna nine gonna be another battle against uh Sue's boy and it's a uh, underused battle and first of all first of all before I start with the narration I wanna say I'm sorry for not uploading before for the last couple of four days. I was in so much pain and uh for the last four days and I'm still under medication but uh, now I'm feeling a little, a little bit better so now I'm trying to upload uh, this battle from the 3DS against Zeus Boy like I mentioned before so hopefully I'm going back on track and the team that uh, you can see right now it has the uh, you know the chest now then I, I didn't get to see all the Pokemon but uh, you uh, actually you you get to see all the all the Pokemon we're gonna set a battle here so he's gonna send the chest now and well I will send my crypto so I was predicting that he's gonna make a switch I was like I don't think he's gonna stay with his Pokemon so I will call me my crypto and I will send my Jolteon because I was predicting and he's gonna send the Primarina so he called his Pokemon uh, on the switch he actually sent Primarina so I was like okay well that's a really good for me so I was like I don't think he's gonna stay I don't think he's gonna stay there. He might send a uh, chestnut, but he actually sent the uh, Cobalion. And I went for the Z move. Uh, the Z celebrate. And that actually uh, is gonna it's gonna come ha hand to me because well I'm gonna be able to actually to raise my all my stats and being plus one and all of them i did some good damage and he decides to go for third down raising his um his physical attack plus two but since i have beat him before i don't think he's gonna like i don't know he, uh, he's gonna have to make a, a switch and on the switch now he's gonna send a chestnut which he's gonna receive the thunderbolt and i did like a third part and it, it wasn't enough though I went for the hidden power eyes it, it, it won't be enough to kill this Pokemon as he goes for the earthquake and that earthquake that actually did some really good damage against my Pokemon I survived the attack with a HP and actually he's gonna die because he had the life orb now he's gonna send the hydro gun and well, uh, I will go for the ball switch because I was like, I might need my Pokemon for later on, my Jolteon, because, uh, well, I don't know, he still has Primarina. And he went for the Fire Blast and I sent my bottom Grass Mole, actually. And I went for the ball switch because now I know he's gonna go for the Fire Blast and on the switch, I will send actually my Arcanine uh, because I can resist the Fire type. And well, I, this time I predict that he I'm gonna go for the uh, wild charge because I predict that he's gonna go for the primarina because well if I go for the fire or fighting charge primarina can resist those attacks quite well that's why I went for the wild charge hoping that actually he goes for primarina and actually that's the case he actually goes for primarina wild charge. Choice band is more than enough to kill this Pokemon, the Primarina, so I don't have to worry more about uh, the Primarina anymore. So he sends Pidgeot and I will send I will actually call my crypto because I might need it for later on. So I send my bottom because my bottom has a full HP and I have my focus shot focus, I mean my choice card on my Pokemon and that Pidgeot is gonna be the mega Pidgeot and he actually goes for the air slash instead of going for the hurricane but i mean I, unless he didn't have hurricane but you know the uh the ability for my uh, for mega pitchers the uh, no guard and thunderbolt it will be enough to kill the pitcher and so pitcher it won't be there anymore to you know to cost me more whatever and <laughs> well he's gonna send a game guard and i get to outspeed this pokemon this Pokemon because I have the Thunderbolt is not enough to kill this Pokemon but I did some really good damage as he goes for the Sludge Bomb and that gets to KO my Pokemon. Now I will send my Bidwill 
and he actually is on the range that I can get all these Pokemon with the uh, U-turn, I, I believe. But he actually is gonna make a switch, sending Cobalion because this is the fighting Steel type, and he knows that he can resist that attack quite well. Well, I didn't, I didn't go for the uh, drill run because he still have the Hydro Gun and ha Hydro Gun has the Levitate abilities that's why I didn't go for that attack on the switch I will send uh, my Jolteon and well and uh, on that range I know I can KO this Pokemon instead of going for the um, instead of going for the Bolt Switch I actually went for the Thunderbolt and the Thunderbolt is not, it's not gonna be enough to KO this Pokemon and actually, I went for Thunderbolt again, and I got to outspeed this Pokemon, so that means he doesn't have the Chase Carve. I almost KO this Pokemon, but it won't be enough, as he goes for the Fire Blast, and that KOs my Jolteon. But now, I can send my Scissor, and I can go for the Bullet Punch on that range. I'm pretty sure that Bullet Punch, it will be enough to KO the Hydrogon. Now he only has the Gengar I believe and he has the Cobalion so he, since he's a steel type I believe that I can kill this Pokemon with a Bullet Punch and let me see and actually it is enough to kill the Cobalion with a Bullet Punch. The last Pokemon that he has left it is Gengar and Bullet Punch and well let's, let's say the Gengar doesn't have the best physical defense so Bullet Punch will be enough to KO the Gengar. So that's gonna be the match against Suits Boy. So well, hopefully you actually get to like this battle and now uh, see you on the next one and have a great day and I'll uh, see you next time later and bye.